Hey guys, it's uh, Moses Castillo with some tips on how to keep your children safe from sexual predators. It's almost on a daily occurrence we see on the news that uh, another teacher or staff from a particular school has been arrested on committing lewd acts upon a child. So first of all, uh, if we need to teach our children how these predators work. So if your child has an adult in their life, such as a coach, a teacher, uh, an instructor, um, that wants to spend more time with your child than you do, that's a red flag. You need to teach these uh, how these predators operate. They want to build the child's trust. Here are some high risk factors to consider. If your child comes from a broken home, maybe it's a single parent, maybe the family, the has gone through a divorce, um, and, or the child is in a foster home, being raised by foster parents. These predators, what they'll do is they'll try to build the trust first with those children, build their self-esteem up, uh, gain the trust of their of that child's support system, whether it's the parents or uh, foster parents or whoever that may be in their life. And once they build that trust, it could take weeks, months, even years before they actually make their first move and commit acts of child abuse, loot acts. Uh, they'll start giving them gifts, money, electronic devices, um, giving them extraordinary privileges at school, those kind of things. So be mindful of those things. More importantly, if and when your child does disclose something like this to you, do the right thing, report it to the authorities. Reassure them what they're doing is the right thing and let them know that there's no such thing as a secret or playing games or a secret uh, activity. And hopefully we could get to the bottom of this and rescue uh, the child from the situation.